the handy dandy box that it comes in. I love it. Like love, 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 love. <laughs> Madison Reed hair color for a while now I think since 2017 um, and I love it there's no odor it's really easy to use but today I'm gonna go to the hair salon and get it done there because I don't really feel like doing it myself so this is the handy dandy box that it comes in I love it like love 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 um, so rock out with me and you'll see how it goes Okay, so this is me before. As you can see, I have quite a bit of grays. There's even some like red spots. I'm not really sure why my hair is red, but I have a lot of grays in the front, um, all around the hairline. I can't really see the back of my head, but you get the point. And this is all of what I want covered. Now let's take a peek to what is inside the box. Every box comes with this amazing inscription that talks about how confident is the new beautiful. I love it. It's very inspiring. And here's everything that's in there. You have your color cream. You have the gloves. You have the plastic cap. Then there is the color activator and then you have the shampoo and conditioner and this is interesting because since the last shipment there they've changed this to be more sustainable we used to get little bottles and then also you have your barrier cream which is very important and then your cleansing wipe so the barrier cream prevents you from getting stains and the cleansing wipe removes any stains then we have this new product, which is Tame. I've never seen this before, so this is an interesting little sample. It's a color protector, smooths and finishes, takes away any frizz. As you can see here, my stylus is applying the color and it's going on very easily. Um, it's You can already see it starting to cover the grays in the front and around the back and the middle where she's applying it. And once she gets it all in there, what she's going to do is start to smooth it all together, go from root to tip to make sure every strand is covered. And that way we can ensure full coverage. But you always start at the front and the roots so that way you can get it covered as deeply as possible. Now that the color is in evenly, it's time to let it sit for a little bit. They provide this plastic cap, so I use it, and then we're gonna wait for about 45 minutes. Next is my favorite part of the process, which is rinsing out the color to make sure that it actually did get applied evenly, and you can already start to see the color taking hold at my hairline. Um, you don't see any of those pesky little grays, and it's super even. I don't even see a sliver of silver. Um, what I love is, that the shampoo and conditioner that they provide which my stylist is going to use next works very well with the products and all of them are made to work in tandem to ensure that your color stays in and is protected one of my other favorite parts is the shampoo uh, excuse me the conditioning and detangling process as a curly girl you know that detangling is super important to keeping your tresses well maintained and to reduce breakage um, and I love this conditioner because it smells very nice and clean it's not overpowering it does leave my hair feeling soft and moisturized and I never have an issue um, with it or having my hair dry out as a result one of the things that I love doing is after getting a shampoo, just looking at it once more. And you can see there's some stains. So like on my scalp, you'll see a little bit of the black color, but I don't mind. But you'll see it's very, very evenly covered. A stark difference from when I first started this process. Now I'm under the hair dryer. This is my least favorite part, but it's the most important part because I don't like to blow dry and have split ends. Now the curlers are out and you can really, really see that it's dry, how well the color has been applied and how good my hair looks as a result. My hair is super soft um, and I feel really great. And then we're going to blow it out and you'll see what it looks like. That dye makes your hair shiny, doesn't smell at all. I think I'm going to have to keep it with all my clients. It is amazing. It is. That's my stylist. Love her. She come see her at Cristo Rey Barbershop in the Bronx. 
Done. Gracias. All right, guys, I am back. Do you see the color? Do you love it? Did you hear what my stylist said? She was like, she loves this color. It makes my hair so nice and shiny and soft. The color is even and it does it well. And she wants to use this for all of her clients. Madison Reed is the ish. And I gotta tell you, I've been using this color since 2017. I am a 2A Pescara Black, I think is the name of the color. Um, and what I loved is when you go to their website, when you go to the Madison Reed website, you fill out a little questionnaire and it tries to match your color or your desired color with one of the colors in their palette. And like I said, mine is Pescara Black. I love it. Um, you can see it covers all of my grays. You don't see any. And also all of the red that was in there too. I think I told you guys earlier, my sister was calling me an Indian ginger. Um, so it covers really well. There's no strong smell of ammonia, so you don't have to worry about the smell overpowering you. Um, and everything you need is in the box, just like I showed you. One of the things that I did love was this new product. It's called Tame um, Color Protect Smoothing Finisher Control Frizz and Shield Hair from Color Fading. So take a look. And the consistency, it's pretty interesting. It's kind of like something that I would use as like a leave-in, like on my curly style, but um, it's really well and it goes into the hair pretty easily and seamlessly. I don't really have too many flyaways. And I don't know, it has a really nice, like clean smell. It reminds me of, and I don't know if you guys will know this, but there was a perfume line called Clean, like way back in the day, they used to be a client of mine. And this is what this smells like to me. Um, Sorry, I digress. I don't know if this is something that I would use often because I like more of a serum or a gloss just to help keep that shine in. And I don't have a lot of trouble with frizz. So this wouldn't necessarily be it for me, but in terms of Madison Reed as a color overall, two thumbs up, it's a yes. Make sure you go and cop that Madison Reed. It's not too expensive. And what I do is I have a subscription. So every seven weeks, I have a new box of color coming straight to me. So you set it and forget it. Um, and then you just color your hair. Sometimes I do it at home myself, but today I wanted to treat myself a little bit and I have my stylist do it. Either way, it works just fine. Um, let me know what color you use. What do you like? Uh, other colors that you've tried and drop those in the comment section below. Let's have a conversation about it and we'll see. Maybe I'll be up to trying something else. Um, but otherwise than that, be sure to like this video, share it with your friends and family and subscribe so that you know when I'm dropping new videos. And as always, thank you so much for allowing me into your life and thank you for sharing a little peace of mind. Until next time, see.